<gasps> the transition worked. I can't believe it. Hello, everyone. Vasive here. Bug. Nope, that's a, fl a flying hair. Hello, everyone. Vasive here. Welcome to a late bonus. No, it's not a bonus stream. That's that's a lie. Welcome to a late stream. Uh, I didn't get to sleep till 7 in the morning. I forgot to put the game on. Um, I didn't get to sleep till 7 in the morning. And then I still had to wake up and go to work. Um, so I was exhausted. And uh, I decided to potentially cancel stream. Where's the sound? There it is. Oh, there's not much. I decided to cancel stream um, if uh, I needed a nap. So I took a nap. And I woke up like 30 minutes after the normal stream would start. And then I got a notification that I got a key for this game. It's called Baron Breakfast. It looks adorable. Um, it it kind of looks, just from what I've seen, it kind of looks like a Stardew kind of game. But the art is kind of adorable. And you're a bear. And I think you have like a BNB or something. And it sounds adorable. Lunar Purge, holy crap. I haven't seen you in forever. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. But yeah, so we're going to give this game a shot. Um, I don't know how long it is. I, uh, the key I got was for beta testing, uh, but the Steam page doesn't say it's in early access or anything. So I think maybe that's for a lot of the keys I've gotten from devs. Devs. Devs have said for beta testing. So I think maybe they're just like a special set of keys, maybe. Um, but we're going to give this a shot. It. I like the art already. And you guys, can, yeah, you can see the big sleeping bear over there. That makes me happy. He, he, uh, he's drooling. Why can't I ever fall asleep on team time? Mood? Okay. Space adventure. I'm going to be so tired tomorrow. Oh my God. I literally just had this problem last night. Mom's going to kill me. I don't like that. Pink's hands got very cold all of a sudden. His forehead felt heavy with crushing pressure. Bird staring at me. A dark figure with glowing eyes stared from far away. Weathered stones and dry wood surrounded it. Suddenly, a blinding jolt of lightning illuminated the sky. That happened last night, too. We had a massive thunderstorm. Constant, like, heat lightning. Couple big booms. It was loud. It was awesome. You've been doing a lot of work, but doing well. That is good to hear. Staying safe out there. Hopefully, life's uh, treating you well. It's good to see you again. If you have any updates, about a uh, Love to hear. Thunder cracked. A shriek pierced through the air. There was no one there. Everything fell dark and silent again, except for the rain. Forget I said anything. Sleep is overrated. Oh, am I playing now? Maybe not. Hello. I can't move. Do not. Oh, you gotta give this a voice. Do not. Don't what? See? Because that's already happening. Move. Can't do that either. Lost to move around. What's up, Rooster? Welcome to the stream. <gasps> Look at me flip plop around. Well, that's convenient. Fine. One, two. You mean like an introspection thing? I'll have to do those in a minute. Sleep. Five. Yeah, sure. I'll just take a nap in the deathbed. This is annoying. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. E to interact. Flip, plop, flip. Ooh, the bed. Heck yeah. Don't. You're not great at making your up your making your mind up. Wait. Uh. Don't watch me when I'm sleeping. That's weird. That's it. No more dumplings before bed. <laughs> For the third time, Hank. Uh-oh. Better see what's up. Oh. Achievement unlocked. Sleep is overrated. Nice. <laughs> Look at me plip plop. Can I interact with this stuff? I have a backpack? Inventory? It's me! What's this? Show walls. Oh, neat. It's 
kind of like uh sims with that can only sleep at night oh that's options okay this this shows uh roofs i want to see roofs Okay, can't go that way. Flip flop, flip flop, flip flop. Oh. Wait. Oh, it's just going to another part of the house. Look at this. Look at this little seat. There's a little owl nightstand thing. Looks like more like a turkey, I suppose. A little bonsai tree. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. I'm going this way. Hello. Look at our little house. Oh. Am I actually turning out the light? Kinda doesn't look like it. Can I use any of this stuff? Hello. I'll talk to you. Hank. I'm I'm up! I'm up! Well aren't you a bag of bones? What is the hibernation hasn't kicked in yet? You can't call it that every time I get a little extra sleep. Besides Besides what? I had a hard time sleeping. Too many thoughts. Other ones in the family. Have you tried thinking less? Gee, thanks, Mom. No, I'm... Where's Annie? Oh, in a room with Will, probably. I should go wake him up. Alrighty, honey. Uh, while in adventure mode, you can control Hank using Waz. Uh-huh. Figured that out. You can zoom in the camera. You know, using mouse wheel. Interact with different things in the world by pressing E. Why is there math? The game uses an autosave feature. Do not exit the game while animation is displayed. Basics, game settings, cool. Uh, I can go this way now. Oh, I thought the game was off center. It's because that's how it looks over here. Um, you got a little person here. Good! You know. Morning! Am I a morning bear? Out! That's not a very good morning of you. There's nothing good about being up this early. That's true. Early bird gets a worm and he's a bird. That's funny. I don't smell any reasons to be up yet. What do you mean? I could smell them a mile away. Delightful. Both of you. What's on the docket today, boss? Digging a new hole next to the other holes. Actually, Mom said she might let us cross the creek today and get check under the bushes for mushrooms. She didn't say anything about that. What'd I tell you? I live for the hunt. How come we never get to do fun stuff anymore? Like a good old visit to the dumpster. We're not allowed past the fence anymore. Besides, there hasn't been any new garbage in months. Well, we don't find any garbage or mushrooms here. Let's go anyway. You're on his side now? It's morning. We're up. Let's go do stuff. They warned me betrayal never comes from your enemies. <sighs> okay, so I have some friends now. For you. Hey, kids, get over here. Get your digging claws ready. Here it comes. Coming. Adventure mode. You can walk around and wreck things. Your inventory. Your inventory is accessed through the adventure mode. You can use filters to organize or throw away whatever you don't want. Press the throw away. This button. Okay. The mini map displays your current location, date, time, and allows you to navigate the world. Okay. Oh, what's this? A lookout point. What's that? What is denim anyway? A curse. It's a curse upon my loins. Hello. What are we doing down here? Ooh. Gravestone? Is this dead? Can't read what it says. Okay. Hello. Wait. Hey, Ma. Morning, kids. Morning, Miss M. M. Did you, did you sleep all right? Did you sleep all right? That, there it is. As good as ever. Good enough. Whatever that means. Good. Today is a very special day. I need you to go on the hunt. All right, point me to the hole. You black moss. What? What? 
I know I said not going past the fence, but you've all been so good. I need your help. Ah! The bush around the house is tombstone. The tombstone is getting a little thick and the flowers aren't in bloom anymore. Is this a horror game? Don't they need to find me a bundle of alligator weed? I can't believe we get to leave this thing in place. I mean, uh, adventure. Oh, adventure! Anyway, Hank, you're in charge of this operation. Okay, this is what I'm looking for. In fact, take the whole notebook so you don't forget. Nice. But don't lose it again. I won't. You will. You will. All right. See you there. All right, you three. And remember, you're getting that bundle and treat back. I want step further than the swamp. Yes, ma. Collectibles. We got a notebook, which is a collectible item. Collectible items are special items you unlock for your character that give various perks. Ooh. You can find your current unlocked collectibles in the character screen. You can now access the quest log from the menu bar. Uh, collectibles. It shows your current quests, allows you to track them and find objectives using arrow indicator. Nice. Collectibles, which will lead you toward finishing the main story of the game, will be flagged. Oh. Okay. Quest status icons will display over characters. Orange means available, blue means in progress, green means ready. Okay. I got a collectible. A half-empty notebook ready to be filled with stuff you shouldn't forget. First page always says, to love, to my love. Allows tracking quests. Okay, that's what that is. I don't know. I hope it's not a horror game. Those mess me up. Will sounds like Yeti's impressions of Tail Cribble. <laughs> um, so that one's in progress. Okay, so the, the arrow's on my mini-map. Why are my friends coming with? What is this button? Oh. That noise scared me. I'm hungry. I should have ate. Three friends found themselves farther than they'd ever gone before. Past the soothing meadows and the quiet streams of the thicket, Margaret would know, but this was not exactly their first adventure. Annie, the... Annie, the Karelian dog. Brief, but clumsy. Will. The polar Will. Grumpy on the outside, but surprisingly, even more so on the inside. And Hank the brown bear. Cheerful and curious. Maybe a little concerned about the promise he made back home. No, Mom, I'm definitely not going to wander too far in, adventure, in an adventurous fashion. Do I crave adventure? I promise. That part was scary. All right, gang. Spr Spread out. Okay. Oh, please don't be a horror game. I'm scared. Oh, hello. I want this. Higher. Oh, that's why the fence. I was wondering if it was because humanity was here. A bunch of something happened. What in the what? I heard it too. We'd better go. But we haven't found the other thing for your mom yet. I'm with Hank. Let's see what that sound came from. That's not what I meant. We're going back. You know what? I bet it's a brand new garbage truck. Don't care. Mom said straight back. Let's go. We also said to get some more gator weed. We haven't found any yet. Maybe there's some in the truck. No, come back! Will is your spirit animal. Oh no. Oh, what's this? Something to observe? So when does Hank battle his twin brother and unlock his devil trigger? <laughs> That's one bit. That says rock. That said rock. That said rock. That said rock. Sign. The timber crossing. Oh dear. All your friends completed. Is that a space rocket? Are they launching garbage into space? I'm assuming avoid that. Oh! Wait. Plus one request a day. An outhouse. Okay, I don't know what that did, but I'm going to take this. 
Go away, bug. All it's missing is a picnic. It's a picnic basket. The sawdust. Right, what's over here? Pond voyage. Love that. The reason all the jokes about Mondays are so terrible is because people only think them up on a Monday. I hope I sniff out something good today. I believe in you. Can't open this yet. It's a shark. Nothing to lose. Nothing to gain. Grab opportunity by the throat and show it to his boss. What the fuck? The strange shark had a shiny, bouncy exterior and wore cool sunglasses. Is he one of like the bouncy balloon things? A little gray speaker box was strapped to his neck, blurting out nonsense. It reminded Hank of Will's TV. Next to it, a clear a little car had a big advert for something called Bon Voyage. Nothing weird, weird about it at all. Nothing to lose, nothing to gain. Grab opportunity by the throat and show it who's boss. Hello? Be part of the next exciting experience. Enticing escape. Electrifying enterprise. Someone in there? You there. Fine. Shit, gentlemen. I didn't mean to push that. I am pretty gentle. How would you like to be the, own the next minor share in the next major maneuver? Well, I'm not anything major, but I do like sharing. Get on, end. I must reiterate, the this, this share is very minor. What do we get it? What do we... What do we get to share again? <laughs> very, very minor. How exactly are you talking? Bon Voyage is a multinational, multi-layered, multi-year friend corporation. What the... Offering secured touristry adjacent goods and services in exchange for valuable personal collateral. He lost me. I don't think he ever had much had me to begin with. Just bring in your old, useless, priceless family jewelry or expensive heirloom of your choice and we'll give you a one to three day all inclusive voucher for the vacation of a lifetime. You gonna take me to a zoo? Sorry, buddy. I don't have anything expensive or a heirloom. <laughs> On Voyage is also on the lookout for brand new ventures and locations. Why does he keep saying it like that? Or it's millions of customers all around the valley. We'll take any location or premises. No matter how run de how run down or decrepit. To offer our very human patrons the holidays they deserve. Wait, for humans? To live here? I don't think anyone wants to live here. They're just tourists. They've seen this before. The humans wander around where Shark Boy tells them. Then they stare at the trees and try to forget whatever they're running from. I read it in a magazine. Humans are whack. If you or a friend of a friend would like to offer your home or house to a Pond Voyage premium premises by restoring, repairing, red decorating, and bringing it up to minimum standard, which frankly no one enforces, and drastically, barely, alter your monthly income. Simply press the green button under my gullet and representative will get in touch. Achievement unlock shark oil. I'm gonna be or I'm gonna be honest. I have no idea what he just said. If I heard that shark right, it's probably sure it wants to give us money. Human grade, primo quality, shiny money. <laughs> All I heard was that humans are coming back. Well the money has to get here somehow. Humans? I've barely seen one in months. <laughs> That's more than enough. Hello, don't you see what this means? With your oddly alarming strength, my foolproof understanding of all the things, a spoiler sports cheerful attitude. I am cheerful. I just don't care for them, that's all. We stand to make a boatload of cash. I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea what you just said. Human, back, money, give, good. I'm gonna be honest. Is anything other than good? Look, let's go tell Shark we're in. We'll just use any broken down shed. They're all abandoned anyway. Within the adventure mode, then you have two additional options. If you're not a fan of the dark after midnight, you can... Why should I be scared of the dark? After midnight, you can sleep until the following morning. This also advances time. And if you'd like to see inside of most buildings, you can lower the roofs and walls. Okay. A creep of faith. Press the green button on the fish. On the, the creepy shark. Can I go into these? 
Yeah, this place is messed up. Oh, what's this? Oh, these are... Okay. So, these are stuff I probably repair, yeah? Oh, I got some valuables. Oh, me. What's this? What kind of valuables did I get? I got four planks. Nice. Oh, there's some more right there. I want this. Yes! Does those just respawn? Because I thought I picked those up. Holy crap, that takes a lot. Oh, I need to pick up the garbage. <gasps> pick up the garbage. Flip plop, flip plop. Oh, this is a person. It's you. You're the one doing the shark thing. I'm going to scare this human. Boo, bitch! He doesn't care. I'm taking your shit then. Give me that sandwich. I could sit in bed and play video games all day. They sure don't make them like they used to. How do they make them look, bud? I just play them. What the? You talking to a bear, motherfucker? Oh shit, he's saying something else. This week's it's lettuce and bel bologna. I hope you like it. You have sale? Oh, you're talking about lunch? Can I go in here? What's this? Oliver's desk. I'm taking your pen. He doesn't care that I'm just stealing his shit. Okay. Taking these too. Thank you. Wait. Oh, there's more? What the fuck? Ooh. Hello. I don't think I can handle the bus life. Okay. Maybe I should just observe this whole area first, huh? Oh, I'm taking this. No, I'm not. That crunch sound. It's satisfying. Oh, I want this. Hey, there's a raccoon. A trash panda. You hang out with your trash, you start to smell like garbage. Rich and appetizing. Okay. Can't go over there. Okay. Okay, this area is a little bit larger than I thought it was. I'm going to take this. Thank you. Oh, nothing in the garbage. Profes Professional trust talker at your disposal. Are you our garbage disposal? At your garbage disposal, that is. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. What's this? Look at me doing cleanup work. So good at this. Okay, so that's an exit. Just keep an eye open for anything out of the ordinary. Can I fix this yet? No. Logger's tools. Oh, I can make this, though. Hey, I made a craft bench. You can now be used to build rooms and craft furniture. Yes. No building available in this area. Okay. Take the stuff. There's an apple core. <laughs> This thing just keeps respawning. Kind of great. Can I fix this? Oh, wait. It's not broken. Ooh. Please. Thank you. Guess we go talk to the sharkman now, right? Timber crossing placard. There are no tasks to be done in this area at the moment. Okay. Nothing to lose, nothing to gain. Grab a tunity by the throat and show us who's boss. Press the green button. Hello again. Congratulations! You've been automatically entered in a standard legally binding agreement. By using your fingerprint identification data from the local police department. 
Welcome to the family. Error unknown pattern. <sighs> Aim suits you. You are now contractually obligated to provide your premium property details within the next three business days. Simply press the green button under my gullet when your premises are ready to accept our first guest. All right, who knows anything about human houses? Well, I used to look at the pictures of houses in the magazines we found. But the humans maybe just live under a bus? No, I don't think that cuts it. They're fragile and get scared easy. Sounds familiar. I think I know a thing or two about making a place cozy. And I do not get scared that easily. Yeah, but I think we need to help out too. We should go find Tony. Really? I don't really think we should bother him. He won't mind. Besides, I think he'll enjoy the company. I don't even know where he is these days. I, did, I doubt he ever leaves. Left sawdust. I'll see if you can f sniff him out and tell him we can. We need his master woodwork skills. That'll get him going. I guess we're going to sawdust. I'm taking this with me. Thank you. I wonder if this is made by the same uh, that did Don't Starve. Uh, I'm not sure. Can I loot stuff here? Bus sign. Oh, lootables show up on my map. Okay, that's cool. I didn't realize that before. That's nice. What's this? This is the biggest crack I've ever seen. Ah. Should I actually be just going doing the, the story? I'm, I'm, this map might be large. Didn't like that noise. I don't have prospector's gear. Okay, so I can't get over there yet. Look at all the shrooms. Someone left the trash can out. Whoa. Hello. She doesn't care. Boo! She doesn't care. The humans don't care. There's mushrooms out there and you can... And they say they give you the worst nightmares. I could sure go for some right now. Okay, junkie. Let's go get you some mushrooms and milk. I wonder where the tree this big could fit. Oh, that's a tree with a drive hole in the middle. I think this would be easier to play with controller. Let's see. Seems the dev team only has this game so far. Oh, nice. Can I not use the controller? Oh, bummer. I'm sure I could, but I started the game with keyboard and mouse. Hmm, why not simply punch the trees? <laughs> Washer outside. Take our the girl bar. Is that just a... Yeah. Just a sign. This is a beaver. Ugh, I hurt a bear. It's just me, sir. Hank from the thicket. Oh, goodness, you can talk. I'm just a cute tail boy. How's your mother? She's great. Listen, I wanted to ask if you could help us. We've got to help. Why did you say so? What do you need? A stack of birch? Well, actually, my friends and I were wondering. An oak soon? Oh, I think Margaret would love that. Has anyone ever taught you how to saw yet? Oh, there's a shark in Timber Crossing. Oh, a redwood plaque for your fish? He says he's bringing humans to the valley. Oh, well, we haven't seen those in a while, have we? What can I possibly have to do with that? How much do you know about building things? For humans, I mean. Well, as you of course know, everything people make is perfect. When I took over the mill before here, I found all these papers and schematics. It felt like stumbling upon artifacts. 
never thought water could take so many shapes. Look here. Elaborate contours, naughty frames. Naughty frames. Perfect angles. Really, only an incredible being could come up with all of this. Whoa. Can you make all that? Oh, anyone can. It's quite simple once you figure out how to read these things. Would you... Would you like me to teach you? Yes. Well, I was hoping you could fix, help us fix up the old shack in Timber Crossing. Oh, how wonderful. I'll need my back saw and mallet, a ladder. Oh, and a couple stacks of pine. That's those for me, will you? The bright yellow ones. They're all yellow. Uh, you can interact with materials in the world. I've been doing that. I see again to the container to take. Yep, I've done that. You can also split stacks. Okay. Scavenging, scavenging is one of the main ways for you to obtain materials. Certain materials will respawn periodically. Unexpected locations. Nice. Wood will be found near trees. Stone and marble in the rocks. Junk around the garbage dump and so on. Materials. Storm any extra materials in the stash near the pond vo voyage car in each area. Okay. So, did you find all the wood? I think so. Yep, got it right here. Grand, perfect. You're doing such a great job. Uh, thanks. I just picked it up off the ground. Amazing. Now, I'm headed to Temple Crossing. I'll see you there. Later, friend. Well, I'm gonna pick up all the stuff. Look at all this stuff right here. This is amazing. something funny it smells like ammonia did you pee somewhere Jada holy crap it's like burning my eyes hold on No idea where it is or where it came from. It smells like ammonia. Oof. I don't like it. It's burning my eyeballs. I'm almost out of pretzels. Alright, we're gonna go pick up the rest of this garbage. Why is there a snake sound? That sounds like a big ass snake too. Can I get jumped at night or something? I'm a motherfucking bear. This stuff better not jump me. Oh, I'm sliding. That scared me. It's fine. It's fine. I can't get attacked at night. That would really suck. I'm a fucking bear. Don't attack me. I'm a fucking bear. Don't laugh at me, creepy bird. Yeah, Birch! Can I Welcome to the stream! Calamari, yeah, I just got a key for it. How you doing, friendo? There he is. Oh, there's my friends. Yeah, we already did that one. Yes, all of this set is wonderful. And we're gonna use this old shed. Haven't seen a human claim it in years. Oh, yes, well, this will do nicely. 
look who finally decided to show up. As I was telling your friend, are you okay, Jaden? As I was telling your friend here, or, oh wait, as I was telling your friend here, the wood you brought out to be enough. We'll get started on this. First, you'll need to have to clean up the shed of all the garbage. I think I can do that. I think I already did it. I did. Did you clean up the shed? Before you even showed up. Great. Now we'll have to use this old workbench. What? Well, you can't hammer and nail it in air. You need some place to make it work. The table next to the tree, Hank. Grab some wood and put it back together while I tidy up the place. I think I already did it. I did. <laughs> yep. Monuments will improve the status of the area and attract more guests. Repairable objects. Passenger or passages will be cleared and bridges will be repaired to allow access. Okay. Can I fix this? No. Did you get the work back next? I sure did. Like brand spanking new. It's good. Enough. Uh, thanks. Excuse me. Look at him trotting around. Who's gonna mess with the bear? A bigger bear. You're right. I should better not get jumped out at night. Baby's first building. Excuse me. You have plenty of time to get better. Now humans get got over the cold stone floors and itchy hay a while ago. They would much rather sleep on a clean, soft, springy surface. Yeah, this is none of those things, but it'll do. Cool. You've unlocked a new crafting recipe, shabby pellet and bed recipe. Awesome. We'll make one of the workbench. Okay. After I pick this up. Oh. I thought the workbench, like I would craft it there and take it. Oh, it's cool. Once prepared, the workbench uses the craft and place objects as well as build rooms. To craft functional furniture, use the workbench and enter the crafting menu. Functional objects are specific to the room types and are crafted with materials. Beds give comfort and belong in the bedroom. Toilets give hygiene and belong in the bathrooms, etc. Once you're done, exit build mode by using the exit button. Learn new blueprints from quests or by buying them and interacting with them to learn the recipe. Buy more blueprints at the Pond Voyage shop as they become available. Okay, let's build a bed. I did it. How do I drop it? Were you able to make the bed? Yep. Got it right here. I didn't think it could look worse than the schematics. But here we are. Oh, I mean, excellent. You're doing well. Better than mine back home. That's just sad. Well, hurry really along and put it to good use. Make a bedroom and put the bed in it. Okay, I gotta build some rooms now. Uh, building rooms. Use the workbench to build and edit rooms with the cabins. Access from this one. Some resorts only support a limited number of room types. Oh. Draw the footprint. Oh, this is like a prison architect. Until you reach the minimum required size, at least. You can add or remove tiles using the plus and minus tile buttons. Every room requires a door to function, but a room can have multiple doors. Add more with the add doors button. Rooms will also require mandatory objects in order to function. Yeah, just like prison architect. While in build mode, grab furniture from your inventory and place in your cabins. You can rotate any piece of furniture pushing R. Confirm building in the room by clicking the check mark. Make sure you, it's not overlapping anything. Edit or delete rooms in build mode by selecting one and using the room panel below. Okay. Bedroom! It needs to be a two by three. That is the smallest room ever. I can't place it in there? Must be placed on a wall. I am. What the fuck? Oh. That. Okay. Needs to overlap. Um. I need a door. I need to build. Ah. Add tile. Where's the add door button?
Right there. Oh. Okay. I have 69 valuables. Nice. I did it! Let me go. Okay, that's what I want. Yay! Exit. I did it, Mr. Beaver! So, are we able to make that bedroom? Yes, sir, stains and all. Well, it. I almost prefer to the dead tree I used to sleep in. You encourage weird. Alright, now this is the most important step. Humans always need to feed their false sense of superiority by having someone around that they can look down on. You seem to know a lot about them. So we're gonna need to make them feel welcome by putting down a little table at the front of the house that tells them where to go. And a little black book to keep the records for the shark. Oh, yes. Here's how you make it. Quite straightforward, really. You've unlocked front desk. After you've made it, just put it down in the shed. And then it's time to take it, rake in the dough. Placing objects while in build mode, you can always place furniture objects freely without having to build a room. Okay. So I need to build... Front desk. Or did you already give me one? You did not. Okay. So let's build a front desk. There we go. Nice. Are you okay, Jada? There you go. I did it. Use the inventory button, then select to place down any objects. Decorative only items can be placed anywhere in the resort. Room specific items can only be placed in the rooms. Yes. Cookie time. Excuse me. Of all things that came could come from your stream, a jump scare shirk ad. Wait, is that shark or Shrek? Cookie time. Thank you so much for contributing, Bert. Get the cookie. Oops. I dropped it. Here you go. I'm getting a cookie for you. It's on your butt. You gotta find it now. <laughs> A Shrek jump scare ad. What the? That's odd. Hello. Did you place the front desk? Yep, it's in there. That looks good. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you're a natural, Hank. Such a fast runner. It's not that great. It took me forever, and there's barely anything in there. Are they even gonna like it? You sure know how to take a compliment. Oh, uh, sorry. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry. Go talk to Sharky Boy. Tell him we got his joint ready. Okay. Hey, creepy shark man. I did the thing. Nothing to lose, nothing to gain. Grab a tuning by the throat and show it who's boss. Press the green button. Hello. We'd like to have some humans over. Congratulations. Your premium property is now listed on the network. I did it. The time had come to unleash something both intriguing and unfortunate on Silver Valley. People. These dewy, mostly hairless creatures were a controversial topic in the neighborhood. Some thought they were godly beings forging the world with their magic and machines, mostly because they left behind food and other stuff that animals liked. Others would throw a fit of rage, calling them unqualified harbingers of doom. A bit dramatic, if you ask Hank. All he knew for sure was that his mom always said, Keep your distance. So much for that. Congratulations. I already did that. You can now start earning hardly life-changing income. Simply accept your first guest through your life desk. Or through your front desk and give them the experience of a lifetime. Front desk can be used to manage your resorts. The resort overview panel will show all the active resorts you have discovered. Where's the resort overview panel? I don't have that. Oh, maybe I gotta act, interact with this. There it is. Each resort will display its available bedrooms, guest requests, and reviews. Bedrooms you build will be listed with their current vacancy status and scores. Every morning, new guests will request to stay. Request to stay your resorts. There's a typo. 
You have to accept them and assign them to rooms. Depending on the resort, each guest will have demands for their room. Use the accept button to accept a guest request. Assign the guests to a bedroom for their stay. Try to match the bedroom scores to the guest's demands for better reviews and payouts. You can get more guest requests per day in an area by repairing monuments. While you are off on an adventure in another location, your resorts will still run. Okay, so do I need to make a bathroom? Maybe I should make a bathroom. Let's do that real quick. Crafting. Okay, maybe I can't. I can make a sandwich! Quest items. Wait a minute. Hey! What the heck is this? They're just quest items. I, I don't use them, I guess. Add window. Oh, how lovely. Are these free? Where's my money and stuff? I don't know. Windows. Money and stuff right there. Uh, okay. Oops. Exit that. Let's go see if I can do a thing. I'm a bear! Details. Details. Guest request. Aha! Hello. Uh, you want... I don't have that stuff. The amount of guest requests you get each day. Um. Oh, they arrive tomorrow. Okay. Oops, move. This is interesting. You're buying the game right now? First ding. Ad showed up. The sound was on far higher than your stream, so I got, you gotta jump from <laughs> I got a human on the way. Or I got a human on the way. Congratulations, you are now on your way to financial independence. In actuality, you are much, much closer to financial ruin. But you have a head start. And that probably means something in any case make sure you keep up with the guests demands and they tend to become as they tend to become pickier and pickier sadly an issue that technology hasn't been able to solve yet okay oh he's got a thing uh oh alert alert it looks like your premium property is lagging the old p department yeah the toilet that's what i was trying to build earlier hey i don't prestige oh wow that means those decoration levels at your property aren't up to our low, low standards. It is ugly. It looks like just like my room. In order to attract more lucrative guests, just make your properties more appealing by adding non-essential ornamental furniture and knickknacks. Guests go crazy for knickknacks. What an uncomfortable sentence. Raise the property prestige level to a satisfying degree before returning. Can I buy? Simple. Oh. Adorable. I want to buy these. Do I already have the shabby wooden bed furniture? We're going to make this a little bit better. Hold on a minute. E. Room. Oh, wait, wait, wait. How do I edit a room? I forgot how to edit a room. I need to... Oh, there you go. You have to right-click on them. There we go. Aha! Um... I'm gonna build one of these. Uh, one of these. Footrest. Okay. How do I edit this room? 
How is that shark breathing? It's not a real shark. <laughs> it's a robot. It's a person with a microphone. <laughs> it's a video. <laughs> How you doing? Welcome to the stream, Fredo. <laughs> yeah, this is your game. I yeah. As soon as I saw this, like this is a Videl game. <laughs> How you doing, friend? Did you buy this game? I don't know how to edit the the things. I didn't read the prestige thing. Prestige is the sum of all decoration scores across the resort. There's a resource prestige score can be found in the resort overview panel. Increase prestige by increasing the amount of decoration in your cabin. Most objects have a decorative a decoration score either positive or negative. Okay. Uh Building rooms. Here you go. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You can add or remove tiles using the plus and minus buttons. Add tile. Here you go. Every room requires a door. Yeah. Okay. So can I... Oh my god. This thing is huge. How do I... How do I edit my room? I want to edit this room. Inky shed. Inventory. Crafting. How do I edit it? The fuck? Well, I'm a bit of mode grab. Yeah, I don't care. Edit or delete rooms in build mode by selecting one and using the room panel below. Where? I don't have that option anywhere. Edit and delete rooms in build mode by selecting one. How do I select this room? This thing is huge. Foot rest. I don't know why it's over here, but it is. On TV? Can't do that. <laughs> I did it! Okay. Go me. making a, a counter-attack block build. Ooh. In Path of Exile. I did that similar thing in uh, Diablo 3. With the, uh, the Crusader with the Thorns build. That was fun, and then they nerfed the absolute shit out of it. It was a bummer. Oh, I'll take this. Trash Panda. I don't remember the voice I gave you. Oh, little big fella. Where did you come from? I live here. Where did you come from? All right, enough of the questions. What are you after? Not sure that sounds like a question. Trash, junk, muck? I'm looking for something humans like. Something that would make them feel more distinguished. Sloth, scrap, and rubble? No, I need something exquisite. That's where you're wrong, my colossal companion. I got what you need. 
You've stumbled upon the most handsome curator of crap this side of the valley. There isn't one thing these animals will throw away that I can't flip back at them. Great. Let me have a look at the dumpster. Not so fast, bozo. How do you... How do I know I can trust you? My, um... Authoritative height. <laughs> Be that as it may. We don't trade with just anyone off the main street. My head would get in the gutter before noon. Although I do spend a lot of time down there. But you gotta be approved before I can sell you anything. I'll tell you what. There's a bus depot across the road. I can smell the stinky tuna from here. Find me a snack and we can talk. I have that sandwich, I think. Did you find any grub? Yeah, right here. Still red crunchy cheese wiggles mustard. That's all I could find. Mm -hmm. Just like one used to make. All right, you <sighs> brutish charmer. You okay, Jada? I'll let you buy my special selection of swill. And here, I'll leave and let you have this one for free. Uh, you know what? I relate to that raccoon. Like, if you get me f food, we're going to be best friends. But anything else comes at a price. And I don't mean none of the stinging human stuff. Tuke's garbage has new items. Awesome. I mean, real valuables. Sick. Duke's dumpster is on your one-stop shop for decorative objects. Duke accepts valuables as currency. The world is littered with them, literally. Guests also leave behind garbage that you can collect and use to buy decorative objects from Duke. Okay. Hi. So how come I ain't seen you around here before? Oh, we used to come here all the time, dumpster diving. Oh, really? Didn't take you for a criminal. No, no, it's not like that. My buddy Will always, will always made me go. You know, it's only magazines and pamphlets, no bad stuff. Relax, my delinquent friend. I'm not gonna snitch if you ain't. Besides, I haven't seen a lick of new humans around here for a while. There's one coming tomorrow. Not since the couple that ran around after a few big inferno. Yeah, we used to never be allowed past the fence in the thicket. Now we walk around like we own the place. Never let anyone tell you that you don't. Anyways, humans coming back in droves, huh? That's pretty wild if you pull it off. And probably make a few folk pissy in the process. Listen. <coughs> oh man, his voice <coughs> hurt my throat. Listen, I get plenty of demands. My business revolves around supply. No humans, no garbage to sell back to them. And especially slim pickings if we don't get any of the rich looking kind. They dump the best junk. I'll tell you what, since you're fixing up the old shed for them, how about you do the same for the kiosk up here? I used to flock around that place like raccoons to a burger wrapper. Oh, dude, I could go for some... Maybe I should order some, like, McDonald's. I got the weirdest craving for McDonald's. It's me. I'm raccoons. I'm getting the hang of it. This sounds a lot more complicated. Nah. This one and done deal. They just need a couple things to keep them distracted. The people know all about it. He was here when they, the place was built. Who knows what kinds of goods we'll have in the future shop. Okay. I want to know what's in your dumpster. I want to know what's in your dumpster. Aha! A bear painting! A welcome mat. I need this. A prayer plant. Adorable. A mirror. Nightstand. Drawers. A rug. Flower vase. Are these stuff I can build later? Maybe I should save up on those. Bringing up Thorns build every once in a while on the forums. You bring up the Thorns? Dude, that was such a fun build. Wait a minute. Talk to Tony. Why is this... Where's the travel kiosk? People don't see the value in what they throw away until you point it out to them, and then charge them extra. Okay. I don't know. What kiosk? Is it the thing you're standing in front of? No. We will took all the garbage. <laughs> Always be checking out the dumpster. Don't check out the dump, Videl. That is unhygienic. Hey! Hello there, bud. 
Aren't you a good looking one? I haven't seen your likes around my bush. I. Buses, not bushes. I would argue you're the rare sight. I like your hair. Soft bear noises. Oh, what are you looking at, bud? What a kind looking bud you are. I am Oliver. The one of the buses here, if that wasn't evident. Ah, look at me. Of course, it's not evident. Bears don't take the bus. Do you? Do you take the bus? What's a bus? I've been in a broken down tractor before. Does that count? What's a bus? Skeptical bear noises. This is just Videl. I don't see why... I don't see why you couldn't either. You know what? Do you think you could do me a solid, bud? I've got this letter I've been dying to send. But I can't leave... Just can't leave my buses. And there's... And there's not been any post since, well... And yes, you probably know these places better than I do. You think you can find your way to sawdust? And give this to Bernie. Beanie for me? Sweet. She usually hangs around the fire watch tower. Oh, that was a lady. That we, uh, we saw. Okay. <laughs> he, he could do with a little more blue. Okay, I'm gonna... I need money. Oh wait, I need to do this. Inventory. Let's give you a... Little nightstand. And a little oil lamp. Wait. Oh! It's a ceiling thing. No, it's not. I'm so confused. Looks like it's a ceiling thing, is it not? Oh, maybe it's a wall. It's a wall. Nope, that's not, I lied. Okay, well, let's go in there. I, that one works. You want, some, you want a rug? This is cute. And then a little, uh, where's that welcome mat? Here you go. No! Oh. I thought it would be outside. A potted plant. Hey! Love it. You want a bear? You want a bear picture? Where did it go? Here you go. Sleep well with your bear picture. No, I don't have room. Maybe you need this is the absolute worst level setup, but it's fine. Videl, I'm busy. Thank you so much for computing, my friend. I appreciate you. I, I said that uh, with the building. I was like, this is just prison architect. did it. Okay. Um. Talk to Toadie about little travel kiosk. Hello again, my child. I mean, uh, my favorite apprentice. Wait a minute. Are you my dad? Don't worry. He's been calling me that all day. Okay. You get used to it. Oh, uh, hello. Look, I have it on good authority that the kiosk up there is our next best shot at getting more humans to come. Oh, you do, do you? And what authority is that exactly? Um, well... Oh, marvelous. The old travel kiosk was the jewel of Timber Crossing. It was one of the first things humans built here. Oh, so kind of like the pyramids. No, you'll actually find it more of a rectangular... Parallelopod... Pipod... I don't know how to say that. A rectangle, what? Uh... So I think I, we could spi spruce it up like we did the shred. And we'll attract more humans and get us even more money, right? Well, right. I still want to know how you came up with that. Oh, it's a brilliant idea, as my usual, as usual, my son, student. Yes, that's what I said. I take it back. You don't actually get used to it. <laughs> well, let's get started right away. Go in there and clear the place up out of the rubble, and then we'll get to building. Uh, I already did it. Nice. 
So, all clean. Yep, almost sparkling. Wonderful. Now, if I remember everything correctly, there are a few things the humans look for at the kiosk. I can make a couple, but I don't have everything I need to get them just right. There's a few oddities I need to get in there, get it all together. I'll need a bit of a human literature. I've got a book back home we could use. There's also an old computer sitting under the tower in Sardis. I already got that too. Oh, and some sort of writing apparatus. Got that too. Holy shit. I think the bus driver might have one on his little bus shack. Great, treasure hunt. Take your time. I'll put together everything else in the meantime. I already did it. Oh. I'm missing one thing. Get a book on spelling from Thicket. Okay. A book on spelling from Thicket. What do you want? Property prestige is the principal proof of a prominent plot. A screen button. It looks like it looks a little better now, I think. Congratulations! Given creature new property pro properties value by a quarter of a percent. That is 278% more of our guests receive on their average trip. More prestigious properties will earn better results, so keep up the work. I did it. Give Beanie alright, oh, I need to go to Thicket. But I also need to go back pick up uh or deliver that letter so let's go do that what do you guys think of this game so far you enjoying it oh what sign wow this looks way different in the daytime sick it <laughs> you're uh you're all sorts of randy today huh video just happy to see a bear. <laughs> she was up here, if I remember right. I like that the humans just don't care that giant ass bear walking on up. I really like the art. Oh! You almost got away. Hello! I don't believe we met yet! How did you get up here? With my feet thief. <laughs> Burbling bear noises. Good! Physical activity is always a great idea! Wait, you can understand me? I've been around these woods for a while. I think I get, a, get the gist of what you're saying. Oh yeah? Then what am I saying right now? Actual literal bear noises. That was pretty unintelligible. I guess I could use some practice. I feel bad, I'm sorry. I'm yoking you. What's a big softie like you doing up here all the way up here? I'm looking for Beanie. I have something for her. Oh, that's a... Just a nickname. I'm Beanie. Or Sabine if you're my mom. But I like... Um, Beanie. No one calls me that anymore. Who told you that? Oliver, the bus person. He gave me a letter for you. Oh, Ollie, such a sweetheart. No wonder he trusted you. Let me see it. I can't believe he found it. Ollie, you weasel. Where was it? Did he tell you? He's not a weasel. Do I understand the resemblance? No, no, he found the best pa page of our atlas. He made this ages ago. He had barely gotten his driver's license and had a much smaller hat. <laughs> we mapped out the whole valley, figured out where to put stations for his buses and everything. I thought this burned up in the fire. I didn't know the fire was that big. Listen, I know you came all this way, but you could get this thing. Could you get this thing back to him? I bet he doesn't even know I have the rest. I got a compass. Nice. Here, you can have this. I'll help you find your way back faster. Uh, which unlocks the area map. Area map can be accessed through the map button next to the mini map. Area map shows all the important markers and landmarks. Okay. Neat. I need to go to the thicket. Where's the thicket? Uh, where was the button? Local map. Oh my god, it shows them moving. That's amazing. I want to... Area exit... No, tell me which is which, bro. Uh, the thicket was where I was from, right? I had a book spelling from thicket. Oh, jeez, that was loud. It's not even nighttime. Did I loot all this? Oh, this was Bernie Shock. 
Bernie shock. Bernie shack. Oh, I got those tools I needed, bro. What did I, I needed those for the outhouse, I think. Huge. Maybe. Potentially. I'm not sure. But it feels important. I wanna go down. Shut up, bird. Hey, we found it. We're going to Hobbiton. Oh, snap. No, I need one of those. Shit. I need one of those. What is denim anyway? It's garbage. Okay, where do I find... Maybe that. Someone. Oh, it's mom. Hey, mom. I see you're running. I see you're running low in pocket money. Oh, my little baby! I knew this day would finally come. The day I would feel useful as a parent again. Well, I can help you out, but only if you have. Only. You have to promise to be more careful next time. All right? Here you go, honey. She just gave me money. Thanks, mom. I go on all these. Can I steal any of this stuff? Can I just go live in my own resort? That sounds like the ideal. I said I get a book of spelling from the thicket. Fuck. Where's the book? Is where's the book? Oh, maybe, maybe it continues more. Like if I go this way, is it still a thicket? Nope. Where's the book of spelling? Maybe in my house. Cause it's not showing up anywhere on the map. Waste power. Bear power. Okay. Book of spelling. Aha! Found it. Let's just do a quick once over, just in case. Look at all this stuff I could just take from my own house and put it in the resort. But it won't let me do it. Is there a fast travel? <laughs> I got things to do. Also, don't I have a, a human visiting today? They should have showed up by now, right? Why is it all goopy sounding? What am I stuck on? Oh, I can't cross the water. Okay. I want to get over there. This is shiny. That's one big rock. It says rock! Motherfucker. Navigating through this thing sucks! Maybe I need boots to walk through the water. That'd be funny. Like rain boots. Okay. Let's uh, return. Oh! She scared me. She, she actually got scared. Like this bird's shit. No one bothering them about not flying. I'm literally walking here. I think she got scared seeing me. That's funny. Only human that's gotten scared of me so far. Hey, I did the thing. Are you feeling okay? Oh, you're under the bus. Back already, bud. Did you find Beanie? Did you give her the letter? 
Yes, I did. She calls you a weasel. <laughs> Affirming bear noise. Oh, you're the man, bud. Oh, or bear, sorry. So what did she say? She gave me this for you. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Bud. She found the rest of it. That's incredible, bud. Oh, drawing on all of this. Drawing all of this out with her was the most fun I ever had. Jeez. Sort of bus driving, of course. Go to sleep then. Of course. Look, there's Sardis and High Lake, and look, this is where we are. Oh, uh, you probably don't know what I'm on about. This valley is huge. These places, there's places the bus couldn't even reach. I know, it's wild. Listen, I've been here for a while. Just me and my buses. But it just doesn't feel right for us to sit on our tires like that, you know? No one's really needed me or my buses in a long time. With all the new folk starting to visit and all, I think you should have this. Look, see where these old bus stops are? If you manage to pick these up like you did with the old storage shed, I'll give you a bus rides for free. That's the tra fast travel, I think. Heck, I don't think bears have pockets for money anyway. Sick! I can go build that other bus one. Or a bus station. Bus station. Look, the first one is right next to here to the shed. How about it? Okay. Uh... You've obtained that list, which unlocks the world map view. The world map can be accessed by clicking on the world map panel in the map area map panel. You can see where Hank is in the world, as well as where areas you have discovered. Okay. Where's the bus station you were talking about? I don't know what you're talking about, bruh. Repair the bus stop in Timber Cross. Oh, it's right here. Sure, why not? Boop. Ba bam We got us a bus stop. Sick. Love that. Hey, buddy. Were you able to find... Yeah, she scared me. Were you able to find everything? It took a while, but here you go. Oh, yes, yes. This is everything I need. <gasps> plippy, ploppy, plippy, ploppy, plippy, ploppy. Yeah, that... Yeah, it won't take that long. Just a few hammer smacks and then voila! Whoa. Well done, dude. Just like new. Sick. Amazing. Talk to Took to inaugurate the kiosk. Is the kiosk ready? It's ready. I never thought I'd see this. Logoria. Excuse me? Yeah. It was 38 across in the 1982 crossword, Simis. I found it in the dumpster the other day. That's gross. No, you're thinking of the other thing. <laughs> found that too. Anyway, you did good, kid. There'll be more stuff for you to buy at the dumpster now. Oh, and I'm putting in a good word for the big cheese. Cheese? Fuck. I gotta go for some cheese. And that made me want, like, a McDonald's crappy burger even more. Like, just a quarter pounder of cheese. Just... Sounds like it would slap right now. All right, Hank, my boy, I've done about all I can for this place. I think you've got a good start here. Although there's quite a bit of work ahead of you still. Thanks, Tony. I'll be back in my mail if you ever need me. Oh, and say hello to your mother for me. I'll tell her to drop by sometime. Mom, beaver wants to bang. Your beaver. Um, Duke's Garage. Gar garbage. Uh... Unlocking shop contents. Completing quests and progressing through the story unlocks more items for sale in shops. Blueprints and cooking recipes only need to be bought one time. Once learned, they will disappear from the shop. Nice. Oh, he's asleep. Sorry, I had to wake you up. People don't see the valley and what they throw away until you point it out to them. Oh yeah, you told me that before. That little fence right there is obnoxious. Hey, dude, I fixed it. Did you get that bus stop fixed? I did. Approving bear noises. That's great nose, bud. Oliver seemed like a friendly, easygoing softy. One of the few people that stuck around the valley. Duke, on the other hand, was a crooked critter with a case for stolen baloney. A strange pair that lived in peculiar harmony. That's great news, bud. Well, that was weird. Was that a bug? I can smell the gasoline burning through my nose hairs already. Listen, anytime you come across a, one of these stops, just give it a wash, slap a new sign on it. Oliver's toolbox. Nice. 
And boom! I'll drive you there any time. <laughs> Hank, Hank, where are you? I'm over here. <laughs> Hank, where have you been? I've been sniffing all over. Well, I met Tony and he taught me how to find some lumber and then we made a bed for humans and... <laughs> and where did you find the alligator weed? Oh no, we didn't find any of that. Just pine and plywood. What's up, Lonnie? Welcome to the stream. Hey, the cookie. Oh, look, and a mama showed up. Love that. How you doing, Lonnie? Welcome, welcome. Any minute now. We also had to use some cotton. Ink. Yes? Mom! There it is. I completely forgot. Oh my gosh, we have to go home. I was busy doing stuff. Bus station. Broken bus stations can be found throughout the world. Repairing bus stations in the area unlocks fast travel to and from that location. Bus posters can be found in Oliver's shop. Oh. Among other oddities. Okay. So I need to go back to Oliver's shop to get more stuff at some point. I will take that, please, and thank you. Uh. Mm -mm. What is it? Ah, punch thing. I can do it. Haven't done this in a while. I need my powdered toast man music back. Yo, you absolute legend. Thank you so much for the tier three at 26 months. You absolute legend. Look at, holy shit. Look at your life, dude. You're going to be stream boss for at least a month. Yeah, the cookie for you. Dude, look at that freaky. That that might be second place for the highest life. That's bananas. I almost said new boost. Rooster town. Also, you get to use that power word thing so you can uh, make a decision in a game we're playing. There it goes! Thank you so much for the continued support, my dude! And for the two or three new absolute legend. Look at that freaking money though. 35k. Hey, yeah, you're gonna be up there for a while, my dude. That's gnarly. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate you. Also, um. Yeah, now that you're <laughs> you're on that account. That should be working, right? Hold on. Let me check. Let me check. No. There it is. There. I'm going to need you to redo that dance. Your lord demands it. <laughs> Thank you so much for contributing, Lonnie. Um. Oh, okay. So do exclamation point power word, one word, uh, rooster, and then paste that into chat and see what happens. How come the potato didn't work? Oh, do I not have that running? I don't have that running. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. We'll fix that. You will obey. There it is. Love it. It worked. And there's the powder toast, man. Everything's happening. Wait, I can't. <laughs> I got to do the dance. At the... You know what? I'm just going to replay this. Oh, it's wrong. The, the gif is wrong. I'll fix the potato in a minute. Oop. Wrap up. I can't do the sideways thing because I'm sitting. There you go. Enjoy. I need my powdered toast man music back. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, now I can do the uh, the potato. Where is it? Twitch channel points. There we go. Run. Potatoes. Hey, potato time. We love potato time. There we go. Okay, everything's normal and everything is fine. We didn't just have a chaos explosion. 
All right, we're going to fix this one real quick. Yes! Double bus station. Okay. Oh, this is huge. Crap. <clears throat> Love this. I am poor potato. I am poor potato. Talk to Margaret in the thicket. Shit. Well, I'm going to go pick this up real quick. I need this. I got to go talk to mom. I forgot. Can I... I don't have a bus station in the thicket. Oh, wait. Yes. Oh. Logger's tools are used to clear stuff, but mm, I might regret that. Luxurious facilities for the unassuming. Definitely an attractive proposal for anyone in emergency. Plus one extra guest. Oh, okay. That might be worth it. Also, I forgot to do this. Leaves in two days. Oh. What are you ding dinging? Hi! Get her. Ah! What's up? Oh, she doesn't care. Okay. She's just used to the bear thing being around now. Everyone is so cute as a potato. <laughs> you found a... You're flush with this, the smush. <laughs> the smush. I need to go to the thicket. Oh, I do have to run there. All right, we'll just teleport over here, and then we'll go. Yeah, Videl, I don't think you've been here since we added the, the new cha channel points. There's a bunch of them. Oh, I'm going to grab this. Can we talk to him? He doesn't have a quest marker. I'm going to check this workbench just in case. Nope. All right, let's go talk to Bomb. Sorry, I didn't find your alligator weed. Alligator weed. Hmm. That sounds suspicious. Mama needs her chronic. Monkey eyeballs for you. Like that. Like, mm. Well, that broke things. That's fine. Oh, I broke it now. Oh, no! I did it again! I somehow did it again. Aha! Fixed. The silence is freaking me out. We're going to go back. Oh, so much better. I'm floating. I don't like that I'm floating over here in this weird ass area. Um, so we're going to fix that. Squeech. Let me move. That's good enough for now. That's just going to have to that's just going to have to be how we roll. Am I smaller? I feel smaller than normal. It's fine. It's not a big thing. Things crashed. Wait, what? <gasps> Am I not streaming? What's up, Coos? Welcome to the stream. I am a potato, sir. Sir, I am a potato. How rude of you. The angel briefly turns him into a pirate. Wait, what? A rotten watermelon. The angle. Oh, you mean like me looking that way? Look at the fuzzy upper lips potato. <laughs> I need these. Fine. All right, we're going to go talk to mom. Oh, that's me. Pink. Pink. Kids. Pink, where have you been? My goodness gracious. Sorry, I was building stuff for humans. Are you all right? Did something happen? Okay, mom. Nothing happened. All right, good. What was in the thick head? That thick head of yours? And you? I didn't even say anything. You put him up to this again, didn't you? No, mom. Will didn't do anything. We weren't even gone that long. It's been days. I saw you yesterday. You gave me money. You've 
friends are coming back. And another thing. They're what? We're helping. I see. Well, I don't suppose anything's wrong with that. We're gonna get more to visit and they'll bring money and trash. We'll get to learn all about them and... And I get to make stuff for them. Me! Tony taught me how to build a bed and... I haven't heard from him in ages. Well, I suppose there was nothing I could do to keep you around anyway. Don't say that, Mom. I'm not going anywhere. I just... It feels nice to do something out there for a change. Something helpful. I know it does, dear. For now, at least. You're all probably exhausted. You should rest. Yeah! We gotta go check on our humans. I got a tucker cap. Nice. Alright, dear. At least don't forget your hat next time in case it rains. Now get some rest. I got a hat. I am a banana! I'm, I'm a banana now. Who's Anton? Oh, don't get up for me. I can see just fine from here. Why don't you see the flaps? Look, I, I can do the helicopter. I'm helicoptering as a banana. We found that out last time. That is corn. What kind of corn are you eating? You don't peel corn. What the fuck is wrong with you? I am concerned. Now that you work in a grocery store, you hate produce. <laughs> People bring me their shit like I'm supposed to know what the fuck it is. <laughs> I can't tell the difference between a peach and an apricot. Lonnie! <laughs> just scan it all. Oh, it's an onion. If they give you grief, just say you weren't trained correctly. Scan it all as an onion. Yes. <laughs> you don't peel corn that... Look. I have banana flaps. That is not a husk. Oh, don't get up for me. You just... You see just fire from here. What? Let's just say you made the right impressions to the right people, pal. That's not true. I did no such thing. Relax. It's a good thing. It is? The oversized rat did say the size doesn't scale everywhere. Listen, you made quite an impact on my trash talking associate, which is rare. In case you feel like keeping that up, the way to the old road's been cleared. If you happen to make your way down there, come to find me at the dump. Why would I do that? So I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. I gave him a fucking mafia accent on accident and it worked perfectly. Oh, I don't know. I guess you could refuse, but it's a pretty good offer. Do what you want. I don't care. New routes have been unlocked. Nice. That was weird. How'd you get in my room? Weirdo. How do you remove the husk? Okay, so... You can't see my hands because I'm on banana mode. Quick trick for re easily removing the husk on corn. Just put the whole thing in the microwave. Like with the husk and all. For three minutes. And afterwards, it's going to be really hot, so be careful. But then you just cut off the back, the part that you break off, you know. You just slice that off. And then literally the husk, and then you grab the husk at the top, the tip. And you grab it and you pull it. And it literally just slides off the hairs and everything. It's fantastic. With a spork and hot sauce? Lonnie, I have quite... My chat is just chose violence today. I'm trying a new VTuber idea. Oh, I... No way. Like helicopter thing? Exactly. I'm, I'm practiced and versed in the skill of mine. Go south of Timber Crossing. Okay. Well, I don't want it. South of Timber Crossing. What are you doing out here? Hey, what are you doing out here? I hope I still found something good today. Do you find secrets or something? Am I walking with her or is the game bugging out? Oh, I was stuck on her and it was making me walk with her. That's kind of cool. Oh, you like helicoptering things. That's what you said. Lonnie Bonk! Not a bear, you're a banana. A bear nana. That's what I am. I'm a bear nana. Go south of Timber Crossing. And enter A24. Okay. Oh 
could be a nice table. Hi, Grandma. Oh, who's there? Why, this is quite unexpected. My, you're a big fella, aren't you? You don't seem very frightening. That's all right. You're not the first creature I meet around these parts. Don't be afraid. I didn't mean to start you. Apologetic bear noises. What is that? Well, it's quite nice to meet you too, dear. I'm Barbara. I've been the keeper of these woods ever since I could tell a jalopy Jeffrey. Uh, jalopy? Where did I get that? Tell a jopy Jeffrey from a blue shag. You know where you are. What's a blue shag? Bear, uh, uh, bear noises. Oh, of course you don't. You're not from around here. I would have known. Well, we're in timber crossing one of the largest lumber hubs this side of the valley. Oh, well, it used to be. Barely a soul sets foot in this place anymore. Although, lately I've noticed quite a few more souls than usual. Almost like something is drawing people back. And then I couldn't help but see what a wonderful little shed we got. Did you have a hand in mind? Did you have a hand? Oh, in that. In that? Nothing with my own two paws. Comfort bear noises. <laughs> Never thought I'd see another person visit our little valley, let alone tourists. I have to say that was quite the accomplishment to do on your own. Hope I I'll see more of your handiwork soon. Hi, Grandma. Oh, what a sweet old lady. The banana has mounds. <laughs> I knew what? Where did the rotten ma watermelon go? Uh, I became... I became a banana for five minutes. God. Vidal! I'm gonna have to put you in the bonking chamber, aren't I? Bad thought bonks. Oh, I found it. Different music. There's nothing to loot here. That's a bummer. Stupid rocks. Oh, wait. Loot. Mine. Sick. Can I loot this? Oh, there is stuff to loot. It's just a different symbol. Give me the rock piles. I like how my bear waddles. Hello, little mouse friend. Amazing top box. Oh, I see you're saying rooster. <laughs> yeah, but LZ emote. Not there either. He either skipped town again or is lining a ditch somewhere. That boy couldn't tell his tail hole from his mouth hole. But he went bail, not on us. Uh oh, 10 o'clock, Chief. What a surprise. Oh, a hefty entrepreneur. Is there a problem, boss? No, not yet, anyway. How did you find the trip, Hank? I don't think I told you my name. You didn't have to. I knew it before your mother did. Creepy. I don't think she knew, sir. Mom didn't name me. Yeah, really is dinner up there, ain't it? Sure is. I didn't catch your name. That's because I don't throw it around. It's on a need to know basis. Need to know basis. Well, I kind of need to know. You won't get far with that attitude, kid. Anyways, I'm Anton. I run the place. What place? Ah, what, what place? This place. Everything the stench touches. Listen, you haven't earned all these questions yet. My collaborator up north says you're up to something good. Bringing people back to the valley. Man, he's hurt my throat. Uh, That's good news for everyone, but we got a problem. One of my crew went missing three nights ago. Claire will fill you in. We last waited at about approximately 9 p.m. near the Black Moss border. We were out doing our scavenge run and I was negotiating a particularly heavy piece of scrap. Ten seconds later, I turned around and there was no way. Just a low hiss of the swamp. You have any idea what happened to him? No, but you will. I'll make you a deal. 
You need me and my dump to get your little adventure up and running. Otherwise, you'll run around for scraps and die of old age before your first customer sets foot in the place. I already have a customer, sir. I'll let you keep any scrap you find if in here if you get us weighed back. We suspect he's somewhere in the black moss. That's where I check first. I wouldn't be sitting around here if I were you. All right, fine. Well, I'm going to go steal all this shit. Oh. Garbage. No, I went in there. Can I have it? Oh, I can't get in there yet. Fine. I didn't want to get in there anyway. Wait, can I steal stuff from you? Oh, I'm stealing all your shit, dude. You didn't say I could have this. Or I couldn't have this. What is this? Trash compactor? Looks like a good place to hide a body. Oh, boy. I Dude, this game it occasionally drops down like the horror vibes and it freaks me out. Plick, plop, plick, plop, plick, plop. Ooh, what's this? Something's down here. It's S Mart. Oh, there's a bus station. Diner sign. Whoa. That noise. Tony's construction service not available. No available instructions. Oh. Well, I'm clearing this out then. Or when we can actually do something down here. I'm actually building a human place. <laughs> With all this stuff. Bon voyage, what are you doing here? You got nothing. Okay. Wait, what? A24 placard. There are no tests to be done in this area. Okay. That's fine. Oh my god, there's garbage everywhere. Oh. Yes! Ah ha ha! Well, that's all set and ready to go. Grab all the apple cores. Where am I storing all this? In my bear wallet. What is this? A condom? Disgusting. Don't leave your condoms laying around. That's gross. Whoa. Wait, 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 wait. wait. How do I close it? There it goes. That's too many things. I'll check that out in a second. Oh! Hello? His name is Gus. I can't hear you cry, Gus. People tell you what you do. When you grow up, you cry because people don't tell you what to do. I just don't do anything anymore. I've worked out so far. Just being a possum, I guess. Oh, it's Barbara. Hi. Well, some people are growing older doesn't come with being a smarter. I want what they have. Same. I like how he walks. I will take that. Who's ding dinging at me? Also, where'd that E come from? Oh, I picked something up. Nice. Yeah, I was gonna say that that would be a, a bear joke. Or a Josh joke. As soon as that came out of my mouth, I knew that I was gonna regret it. Very rustic coffee table. Look at this! It's a possum clock. That's actually kind of adorable. I'm buying it. Large snake plant. Book cabinet. Coffee table. Scented sticks. Nice. 
Cool. I got some stuff. What's it? What's down here? Who left this? Who brought their freaking? Whoa! Holy shit! Their <laughs> their sofa out to the woods and just dumped it. Whoa! Input lag. Stop it. Steel plate. Okay. Definitely not the way to go. Okay. All right. I suppose we're gonna just continue our little mission quest thing here. Stop with the snake noise. Oh, hello. Ah, oh, another entrance. Okay. Hello. Sofa. In the middle of the woods. I would not touch that. Charcoal lily. That sounds like it would be used for like a dye or something. Just pick up all the things. Who's this? There's moss all over it. Oh, I can't go that way. There's a freaking wizard in there. You guys see that? There's a wizard. No, it's an alligator. It's an alligator wizard. I'm sure there's a pun in there somewhere. I just can't place it. H Hello? Oh, well, this is good. I swear on my tail. Oh, wait, Charlotte. She's blowing like bubbles. I swear on my tail. What happened to this type? Stuck a hand down the drain pipe. Bad mushrooms. Heard a noise come from the trees. Oh no, I was just looking. Cause I hate to break to see all the trees make noise. That's pretty much all they do. They sure are selling doing it for you. I'm sorry to bother you, ma'am. I'm just looking for a friend. A friend? Yeah. Happy hour ain't what it used to be. He's pretty small and I think he got lost. I'm worried something happened to him. Small? How small are we talking? Because small things don't last a long time around here. <laughs> you get hungry. Unless you mean shelf life. Oh gosh, no. It's a rat. His name is Wade. Oh, crickets. Someone came looking for that. Or that thing? You should be paying me rent. Yeah, I know where your aid is. Unfortunately. Go inside. I inside? Oh, don't go all brave on me. You're too big for my cauldron anyway. Uh. This is like the starter wizard, dude. Oh, here we go. And then, just before the tire head boss pulls up his cane and smacks it out of the way. Oh my god, who are you? What are you? You're like a little salamander. Oh, go, 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 what happened? We got the pieces scrammed. Well, what was it like? The thing. <coughs> I mean, the little artifact that you just released him down in less than an hour. Only just about the grossest cataclysmic comforter you've ever seen. Wow. Look at her little anime eyes. <coughs> What's up, Kara? Welcome to the stream. It's a thing, too, real bad. I think a cockroach laid a minute before we found it. Whoa! Thing when I say about liaising with the criminals. Liaising? Criminal? Where? Got some, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. Besides, we have a guest. A rather unusual one at that. Wade? Are you Wade? Hello? I mean, no, I'm not. Oh, yes, he is. A festering, noisy pest that can. A uh, festering, noisy pest that can keep his tail out of his other people's business. I was prepping him for a pick pickling if you need to know. Tiny bones make for great feather boulders. <laughs> no, you are not. I just said you didn't know how to get rid of him. Just child. Who wants to know? I'm on a mission to get you back to the dump. Your boss is worried sick. You talk to Mr. Ray? Well, more like slightly preoccupied. I can't believe he sent someone after me. Yeah, he told me to bring you back and he'd let me use the dump. Yeah, he's just holding back my dump. So I can get more humans in the valley. He never lets outsiders in the dump. You must be something special, mister. Well, let's... 
not get too hasty, Mr. Special. This rat isn't leaving this place just like that. But he said that you wanted him gone. Of course I do. But now you want to take him. Well, there's value in circumstance. I ran enough charcoal lilies for my pickle juice. Well, I picked some of those. You wouldn't find him anywhere else. But... Find him anywhere else but black moss. Or maybe the bird brain in A24 has some for sale. He just gets them here anyway. Yep, switches wholesale. Bring me back to be on about jailbreaking your new crown friend. Here you go. I got them. Got what I asked for? A dozen, a dozen leaves, like you said. One, um, two, uh, yeah, that looks right. Good. This better have been worth your time. Because next time you're taking back in a jar. And paying double. Thanks for helping us out, mister. Miss Charlie can bend, can bend after the lilies like she used to. Just child. I like the little salamander thing, whatever it is. Was that our brave essence? There was a brave reference? I missed it. Charlotte the half-tailed alligator. She's has, she has half a tail? Oh, I thought she was in her cauldron. Struck Hank as someone who was good at trying to be scary. But didn't always stick the did, but didn't always stick the landing. She's putting a frog in. Don't put the little frog person in your pot. I love her. Her. As evidenced by Twiggy, her tadpole buddy. I love her. Who, by their mere tiny presence, debunked any worry that Charlotte would actually try to fit Hank in her big boiling cauldron. That's a hope, at least. Just child. All right, big sweep. Yes, ma'am. Scram. Yes, ma'am. Thanks. Later, dude. Saving Private Wade completed. <laughs> can you move faster? Don't go right. No! I can go around you. Ah we break free. Okay, I need these. Don't cross the bridge before I get there. Shit. Oh, the regret. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's... oh sweet. I can go around her. Oh, wait, bug. Oh, look at this willow. That's cool. Presents for me. <gasps> Are you following me? I almost fell in the cauldron when Spishy see me at the last second. Although I'm pretty sure she secretly wanted to see what would happen. Oh man, she's pushing me around. I like Twiggy. How many days have passed? Did our lady or our guest finally leave? Wade's got his little box. And you're not stepping one foot outside of this stinking dump. Not one foot. Yes, ma'am. Four months. Yes, ma'am. Ooh, look at that golden nut. Everyone's after that golden nut. Everyone getting their golden nut. The first rule of... I thought that said gynecology for some reason. Garbar... <laughs> Garbarcology. Garbicology is the cream always rises at the top. So make sure you dig down deep. Player obviously. Player's obviously the right hand of the operation. Her skill at finding the best stuff is only matched by her loyalty to the old rat. Anton and the boss seems like real hard ass. But I guess you gotta be in his line of business. Wade would be closer to the left hand of the sting. Useful in limited capacity and only under strict supervision, at least according to Anton. What a strange bunch. Yes, ma'am. I always say I've had enough of him. But then I remember the advantages to having an extra pair of paws on hand. Like for sending out on wild goose chases? Exactly. You're welcome. Don't flatter yourself too much. You did what you were told. But I suppose there's other end to this bargain. And we always keep our word. Give me that trash. Yes. It's so dark. Can't see anything. Let me in. Let me in. Oh, I'm like a bear in a trash heap. Are any of these steel? Because I needed steel for something.
Oh. What was that? Oh, snap. There's stuff down here I didn't see. It's like a little house. There's a freaking peacock turkey thing in there. What the heck is that? this weird name for a road honestly okay oh, what's this nothing but pavement from here okay oh i do have two steel plate whatever it was i could build i can build now hi friend ah! i got the best deals anywhere wait yep stewage Oh, right. The alligator's name wasn't Ipswich, but I unlocked something for you. That's nice. It's something I heard a guy once say. Really? What do you got? Oh, I don't care about that. Nothing for me. All right, let's go. Let's go roll around in the trash pile. I don't have any prospector's gear. It's fine. More trash gems for me. I'm assuming these are just on a, a rotating cooldown. I want this. I want this. This. And this. Cool. Let's uh, go back to our little resort and see if we can do anything then. Okay, so I have no current quests, unless you're popping up with one. Let's see. Nope. Someone still staying here? Nope. You're pulling someone new? Hey! Motel. Oh! That was the place I found down there. Okay. Details. Hey, I got a five-star review. Look at me, Goo. Yeah, look, look at me, Goo. Great, lovely experience with and great host. We'll be looking in advance for my next trip. I got 350 monies. Oh, yeah. I got no guest request? Rude. Okay. Um. So do I make multiple bedrooms in this area? Is that the thing? Maybe that's what it's wanting me to do. That could be what it wants me to do. My webcam thing just restarted again. Um, let's, let's see, let's test this theory. Whoa, input lag, stop it. Um, we're gonna build. I don't know. I want more tiles. I want more tiles. Fine. Okay. Then we'll do, um... Oh, I need to make a bed. Oh, man. Make one of those. Let's do this again.
Yeah. They're just going to be essentially mirror images of each other right now. Um, I have... I don't know, I don't know. There are invalid objects present in this room. How? How? There's a door. And a bed. What the fuck? No. No, there's not. You're lying to me. Oh, stop. Stupid webcam thing. Um. Something is weird. I do this. Potatoes. I'm a potato. I'm getting potatoed again. <laughs> Thanks, Birch. Oh God, butt flexes with it too. Potato butt flexes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15. Ooh. Ooh. Right, we got that. And then we're going to... Little book cabinet. And then, uh... A little some... Scented, uh... Apparently not. Shit, did I just drop something? That would be unfortunate. Hey, do you want a little possum clock? Can't go into a bedroom, huh? Possum clock. Yeah, like, this has a thing. Looks like I should be able to put something on top of it. But it's not letting me. Look, there's a, there's like a, a dot symbol. Like I could put something there. But it's not letting me. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Furniture, craft, cook, blah, 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 blah. Maybe I should make some more of those things, huh? I was able to build it over there just fine. Alright, so I need a welcome mat. I suppose I could... You need to do a few more butt oh my god! So many butt flexes today! anything else yet. I don't have uh, any other paintings either. Oh, there's one. Wood shelf. Interesting. All right. I might have to come back to that. I keep pushing escape. To close menus. And it's not what it's for. Hey, shark man. 
Congratulations! Seems that your first property is coming along nicely. Now that you're earning the equivalent tips of a door to door salesman, door to door door salesman, <laughs> you are presented with the opportunity. In order to achieve the prestigious Pond Voyage pedigree, you have to bring the property in this area up to our standards. What is that? Complete the stay for plus two guests in Tipper Crossing. Okay. I gotta. I gotta drop some things. This, uh, we're gonna do a welcome mat. Welcome mat. Um, I'll give you one of those. How about a little painting? Why can't a painting go in here? That's rude. worked potted pie plant <laughs> didn't i buy a, a shelf unit i thought i bought a shelf unit there now it worked okay i guess that works um where is my details? Can I rename these? How come I'm not, I'm not getting any guest requests here? Oh, I need one more thing for prestige level. Hold on. Oh. Bummer. I was hoping that Decorative items you could just place. I only can build bedrooms. Um. All right, let's. This footrest thing is obnoxious. Oh, it gives plus two. Comfort and plus two. Oh. Oh, snap. Maybe I should build some of these things. Hold on. There we go. Can't go there? Come on. Bruh. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, fine. And damn it. with the wall. Yeah, that blocks so much area. I don't like it. tell which way is which. I don't think it actually matters. Good enough. Um... Oh, 
don't know what the footrest is going to do over there, but uh, it's over there. Ugh. That one is a uh, nasty layout. Oh, crap. I didn't put that back. I guess the guests don't care how crowded stuff is, which I guess kind of works out in my favor. Large snake plant right there. Lovely. I don't know. How do I, um... I want to get people to come in. There we go. Prestige level 3. Love that. This one has 10 comfort and 16 decoration. Why are these backwards? That's annoying. <laughs> or not the same. You think they would always have like them in this certain orders or something? Perfect reviews. Why am I not getting people? How much money do I have? You know what? Let's go to, um, we're going to go south and see if I can actually get the, the motel or whatever that's down here set up. Why are you here, rattlesnake? It's not gonna let me build here, is it? I think I already tried this. Balls. Okay. Well, I would try to complete that mission, but... I'm not getting people that want to come in for some reason. I thought they said every day I would get a request. So that means I should have people in my options, right? Why aren't they there? Also, I feel like I definitely shrank my webcam. It's fine. Um... There we go. Why did it take so long? This guest six was a higher than average decoration score. That's fine. Will it tell me how much they're paying? Total cost per day. Here, you can sign. Here. Higher than average comfort score. Maybe you can stay here. Did that work? Maybe I can just build more rooms. You know? Come on. There you go. Move this. Move this. All right. Well, let me do it this time. That's red. 
I don't know if that means anything. Why is this color? Oh, I need a bed, right? God damn it. Let me... It should just let me build... Oh, it does. Nice. I didn't think it let me do that before. Comfort this, this. There you go. Okay. Um, let's build... These things. You go here. You go here. Let's get you. Oop. It's not going to fit. Fuck. Stupid tiny ass table. Um. nasty but it'll work <laughs> and your tiny little baby plant just hiding around in this corner <laughs> it works it works it's fine it's fine it's fine don't question it let's go buy a painting from a, a friend actually can i can i pull someone in now Here you go. All right, let's get you. And we'll get Paula Schultz as well. I think, maybe. Let's go buy uh, some deck holder. Did you see the Attack on Titan skins in DVD? I did. I didn't really watch Attack on Titan. I saw the first series or uh, season. It looks like the property in the area isn't, isn't up to par yet. Come back later when you're standard. Any standard is achieved. Rude. Spirit does look good. I agree with that. She looks pretty sweet. All right, let's get a uh, decorative prayer. The jukebox? Oh, shit. That was a lot of money for that. Did I buy it? Oh, I don't have money. That's why. Hand-painted drawers. That's cute. Um, bear painting. Let's get this one. Janky bathroom mirror. Oh, that's kind of cool. I'll take that. Okay. I'm gonna grab that too. All right, cool. And then we'll uh, try to build a fourth one and then uh, grab the other lady because her requirements were a lot lower. Oops, not that. How do I delete this? How do I delete it? I want this gone. No, 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 not add window. Remove window. How do I delete it? Fuck. I don't know how to delete it. Well, let me. Also, I forgot your welcome mat here. And... 
Didn't give them a rug yet. Wait, what? Oh, that's a painting. For some reason, I thought that was a fucking rug. There you go. Painting for you. Um... How do I delete these? I don't know how to delete. Delete. Now it's working. It's fine. much for the the good vibes how the that thing freaked out again why did that all of a sudden freak out nothing got changed what the heck is going on here and i still have to focus obs again for some reason that's really obnoxious thank you Barsh. i appreciate you i didn't push anything that's what's weird Unless I push delete and it activated something. That's annoying. Okay, so we got a thing there. Oh, that's smaller than I thought it would be. Okay, so I need to build the wardrobe and stuff again. So let's steal that. Uh, I also need a bed. There we go. All right, let's build a room. Uh, come on. I could feasibly add stuff to this, but it's fine. Move the door. Add the welcome mat. Then we'll add the bed. Oh, this thing. Delete. There you go. Nice. And we're gonna add this thing. You can have a rug as well. Right there. It's type table with some, oh, you need a light. Can't just put stuff willy nilly, huh? Alright, I need to go buy a light. God damn it! Go buy a light! Actually, let's bring that lady in first. Details, requests, you, bedroom four. There you go! We're all arriving tomorrow, too. We're gonna have a busy day. Let's go get us a light. I should check that. I don't remember what that's for. The kiosk. Let's get the... Oh, he's running. Running right into me.
Let's buy that. And a little plant. I am out of uh, decorative stuff, decorative money juice. He's a runner, he's a track star. Oh, I'm missing something. What do you want about, Lonnie? Are you talking about the raccoon? Is that a song? Or I just not get it? Am I getting too old? Am I getting too old to be too hip? Do you know the two cool songs? Oh wait, you don't come in here for this. Um... Inventory this... Adorable little plant. And a light. There you go. Lights! Light it on up! We love it. Cool. Things are happening. Things are working. Things are good. No idea where I put these. They're just kind of here. There you go. Oops. Cool. Is it bedtime yet? Can I? No. I went to pass the time. I think I can almost do it. Oh, Bustine. Ah, <gasps> loggers tools. Hey, buddy. It is two nighttime. It is nighttime. I hear the nighttime animals. Do I need to like? I bet you, you have to, like, leave the areas to refresh things. Because it doesn't think it's nighttime yet. It still doesn't think it's nighttime. Okay. Scratch that. I need to buy more blueprints. What's the difference between that one and the one I own? Shabby wooden bed. Two, five comfort, two decorations. Oh, it is better. Damn it. I shouldn't have built all those other ones. Question is, will this one fit? Oh, wrong thing. It will. Huge. Hopefully that doesn't cancel like my reservations or something. That would be hugely unfortunate. What happened to the... Oh, it's not stacked. I guess we'll, we can just hold on to those for now. Or when I'm building other places. But for now... God damn it. I'm set. I still can't sleep. It's nighttime. What are you talking about, game? I need slightly more money so I can buy the bus ticket. <laughs> Look at him running around. So I can build the one in 
the dump area but below me. Um I thought I could drop stuff in here. What happened to my possum clock? I don't remember what I did with that. Oh, I can't afford it. Lovely. It's nighttime, dude. Why can't I sleep? weird. Oh, I have, I have no, uh, light in the main area here. Wait a minute. Oh, I thought their requirements went up. That's my bedroom. Ratings. Nice. Bedroom 3 is dope. I, I can't sleep. This is obnoxious. Why can't I sleep? I guess I'm gonna go up here then. It's not gonna let me sleep. I can't go up there. Fine, I'll loot all the things. Why won't it let me sleep, dude? Some weird bug. Now I can. That was annoying. Right, you're not used to bears yet. How soon do you pay me? Yay! Enjoy your stay. Give me your money. Oh, he's going to pass out. Ah! Hide! Is that the same lady that we had already? Enjoy your stay. Go play at the kiosk or something. Go run, roll around in the trash pile, I guess. I wish this area was unlocked for me. Maybe I gotta go talk to... The beaver. I uh, can't remember their name. Not Gus. Oh, like this. Thanks. I need this for decorations. I kind of want to get a, a light in the main area. Oh, double washing machine score. Broken down radios, toasters, and remotes. A veritable treasure trove. Give me the tanks. Yeah. Oh shit, sorry, Mike. <laughs> sorry, chat. Push the crap out of that. 
maybe uh i need to go talk to my beaver friend because i found this new area and i built the bench that is my theory where is he he's not in the thicket Boo! See, now they're scared of me. Uh, I think he's in sawdust. Let's go there. Where are you at, buddy? Yeah, here we go. Can I actually loot that? That thing looks lootable. This. It's been sitting there and I keep looking at it and I never even tried it because I kept getting blocked off by the map padding. Right there. All right. You got nothing for me. Is it just me, your local wood Samaritan? All right, maybe, maybe go back home. Maybe, no, because it, it would be in my quest log to say hi to mom, right? For the guy. Might as well loot this stuff while I'm here. Excuse me. Don't hiss at me, snake. Excuse me. That's a big tree. Holy crap. Okay, so, like... I guess I'm kind of just, like, in a dead spot right now. I have to wait for... Because I think I got two one-day stairs, and they need to be done and leave in order for me to finish this current quest I'm on, I believe. Because other, other than that, I'm kind of kind of stuck. I can't do anything uh, to progress anything. So I'll just run around collecting stuff. Um, I'm gonna buy a light. Uh, what light do I want? Play this one. Yeah, let's run with that for now. Ah, running into me. Oh, look, people in the chaos. How do you see me through the freaking wall? Oh, I'll take these. Just dropping your trash everywhere, bro. Okay. No idea what's happening. I am a bear, and I'm making a resort for humans to stay at. You don't think you're a cozy gamer? <laughs> That's fine. Sometimes it's nice to kick back and play something like this. Um, we're gonna put this here. There, now we get a light. Nice. So now I don't know what to do. Boo! I don't know why that's that's satisfying your brain needs stress that's a that's a bad sign says your brain's addicted to stress You just leave trash everywhere. Hurry up, nighttime. See, now it's nighttime again. Boo! Man, they just dropping litter everywhere.
All right, I'm going to go down here again and see if it works this time. <laughs> that is true, Lonnie. Okay, I can't sleep still. I like games like this where if there's like a, a good turnover and you feel like there's like some constant progress going. Uh, every once in a while. But I, I'm generally a uh, like action type game. S same. That's more my style. Maybe I should rotate this. Boo. If I can put a door. I cannot. Oops. Oops. If I could have put a door there, then I would have rotated things, but it's fine. What are you guys doing? You're just walking around literally doing nothing. Boo. I'm a bear. You got Animal Crossing? That was big hype. As soon as kids got on your island and you quit, did they mess it up? I only played that like for two or three days and it wasn't my kind of game. And I 100% I did not want to go farm for villagers that I watched other people do that. I'm like, this is, this is fucking awful. This is not enjoyable. I would not want to do that. Yeah, Animal Crossing was a... Uh, not up to my speed, I think. It was cute. And, uh, interesting. A little something new. But it just... It didn't... Like, I didn't find myself like, Oh, dang it. I can't wait to go back to my Animal Crossing Island. Animal Crossing Island, you know? I like, um... I mean, they're, they're different kinds of games, but in a game like that, where you like decorate houses and stuff, um, I'm more of a, like a Sims player when it comes to that, I guess. And, uh, I get really tired of, cause my, my brain, when I see like shinies, like you saw, like I running around and I'm just picking up stuff on the ground because it's there and that game animal crossing is built on that and i feel like i can't progress anything because i'm constantly like uh it's the next day i gotta go water all my plants i gotta go dig up all my things i gotta go shake all my trees and i feel like i can't get anything done because my brain tells me i have to do all that you know i don't have a, I don't have a hundred or two hundred dollars damn it so it's i really feel like i don't do anything or accomplish anything in that game. Maybe chop down your archers, drop shit everywhere, take my things, then I'd have to farm so much shit to afford them both. Them. I would have just been like, no, you're not allowed on my island. Get the fuck out. <laughs> it was not relaxing. Yeah, that sounds stressful as hell. Still can't sleep. How is this not nighttime? Does this up there that there's a moon moving? Does that literally have to be in frame? And did I just find by like chance? When I cross this, it caused it to happen. Because it's freaking nighttime. I don't know what you're talking about. Mom, IRL, and mom and in game. Yeah, that. No, oh, games. Games gotta give you that little bit of escapism, right? Boo! I'm a bear! <laughs> I don't know why. That's just fun. Let me sleep. Oh, fuck you, bug. For some games, progress is so incremental that it might as well be worthless. Yeah. Um. What was one game? There's one game I recently tried. It was like, I feel like the progress system is so, like, you could cut from progress level 1 to progress level 10 you could cut like six of them out because they just felt worthless. It was literally just a jumping stone to get to the next one. It didn't really do anything for you. I hate when it does that. I think um, maybe it's oxygen not included. I'm not going to commit to that because I'm not quite sure because it's been a while since I played that. But I remember getting 
uh, not liking Oxygen not included too because it's just just also not my kind of game. I wanted to like it, but the progress didn't feel like progress, if I'm thinking correctly. There's no escaping your daughter's expensive ass taste in game or IRL. Oh no. Warframe is like that. See, I keep wanting to try Warframe. Um, I watch a lot of Charlizard play. Uh, that's, that's her main game that she plays. And uh, it looks really cool and stuff, but I remember when I was playing it in early access or beta that I was like fucking a dude this is I feel like I'm not getting anything done I'm not progressing at all you know I don't know I do want to give it a shot again one time though or at some point sweet I'm gonna go talk to this guy and then we're gonna load up again Please make sure your property or your property is up to pawn voyages uncompromising standards. Press the green button. My standards are as un uncompromising, uncompromising as they can get. I can read. Congratulations! You've met the absolute bare minimum requirements for being a halfway decent service provider. The world is at your fingertips. Who knows? In a year or ten, you might be on your way to the minimum tax bracket. But enough talk about a bleak future. Let's talk about a bright one. Your next venture with Pawn Voyage. Remember, whenever you want to add a new premium property to the pond network, find your local pond shark and just press the green button. Ah, do I need to go to the motel? All right, let's let's get some few more people in here. I'm dropping shit in here, bro. Guest requests. Uh, I have two things I can do. Does it tell me how much they'll? They'll pay. You know. Wait a minute. Why can't I sign them all? Wait, what happens to the current active guests? That's not good. Elvin Osborne. I'm so confused. Finn leaves behind construction placards in every area. These placards have optional building and management requests for each resort. Each. Okay. Each will reward you with extra money or special collectibles. Upon completion, new guests will demand better accommodations but also pay for more for their stay. Okay. I gotta look up for that thing. It is a 20 hour of suck before you can hit the awesome. Yeah, see that's, I have zero desire to do that. You're gonna make me play 20 hours for your game to get fun? No, thanks. Super boring and repetitive, but once you get a frame you like and the weapon that tickles your fancy, the grind feels good to do for a long time. Yeah, I hate that. I hate that idea. Where's? Oh, down here. Ha! Nothing to lose. Oh yeah, we read that. Press the green button. Hello again. Be part of the next exciting experience, enticing escape, electrifying enterprise. Yes, you've said that. I'm already part of one. Welcome to the arid plains, the des desiccated desert. We're sitting in a parking lot. The wild wasteland. I can't believe I'm following a fish suit around. Day 24 is the main artery of the valley. When guitars hum the tunes of old country roads. This is the one song, one they sing about. And this brand new premium habitation facility is the first and only stop for the brave explorer on the run. And it's a, an oasis is, a, is an otherwise barren realm. There's literally a shop across the road. Make no mistake, adventurers can't be expected to live off a tent and trail mix. They require the best am amenities. Which is the perfect point of expansion for your now chain of premium product or pro properties. I'm sensing a lot of cleanup work. You should always trust your senses. I already did that. Check the sign next to the motel. Welcome to the roadside motel. Would well, you like to repair it? Absolutely. Step one, clear any debris and garbage inside the structure. Did that. Yep. Good job. This is not a step. Just thought I'd let you know you did a good job. 
Step two, gather construction material needed to repair the structure. In this case, pine wood planks, iron nails, and stone. I got them all, nice. Step three, get your butt to work. Look at it, I made a thing. Extra materials. Whoa. Oh, look at the ground here, dude. This is pretty sweet. Can I build other floor plans and stuff now? Aha ha 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 ha. Neat. Okay then. Um, so I need to build a front desk. At the very least. Oh wait. Alright. Front desk. Um, what do we got for special? The distillery. What the fuck is a distillery? Okay. I don't care. Uh, hygiene. Bathroom. It's a three by three, huh? Sink, toilet, showers. Oh. Maybe I can't make that yet. Shit, where do I get this sink, toilet, and showers? That's not good. Um... buy that oh two things here hey in the middle of the desert in a rundown metal shack lived Gus the most handsome possum in A24 it seemed like digging through drunk was the main activity around here and he was no rookie although by the looks of it Gus's primary concern remained his charm and driving wheel hey oh hello Hmm. I'm Hank. Okay. Who are you? Gus. Nice to meet you, Gus. Yes, it is. What do you do, Gus? Not much. You don't seem to talk a lot either, Gus. You don't need to. That's fair. Well, I just wanted to introduce myself. Not exactly putting your best foot forward there. But I've only got the two. Better start diversi diversifying then. I think, or I think you're being a little rude. You're right. You're actually perfect. Thank you. What's with all the people? Actually, I might have a hand in that. Good. They got the best food and baubles. But they scare easily. A jerk's dream. You don't seem like a jerk to me. Hey, watch your mouth, buddy. We don't take kindly of those types of words. Anyway, they used to roam all over the place. Reminded me of chickens. Stinking, stinky, floating around, afraid of their own shadow. Only stopping for the occasional turd. Living the dream, really. Well, you might start seeing more of them again. Doesn't bother me none, as long as you don't stink up the place. And maybe don't burn the joint down again. All they left last time was a scorched sandwich and a half a toilet. I almost got my little driving wheel too. I love my little wheel. Worst part is, sandwich turned out to be a stinking leather book. Ask me how I know. How do you know? You're not really playing with a full deck, are you? <laughs> I don't really like gambling. Lad, you've got a nice thick skin on you. That, or that you're thick as gravy. Either way, I respect it. Thanks. I like your skin too, I think. Hey, what did I say about saying stuff like that? We don't do that around here. So what's a cheeky boo like you creeping around people for? I'm not creeping, I'm helping. Right, right. So making some extra beans on the side. Getting kick out of scaring their little mustaches off. I think they're pretty neat and I like the building part. And my buddy Will isn't too upset about the money. Bleh. What are you gonna use it for, buying food? Nah. <laughs> How come you live out here in the middle of nowhere? I prefer it that way. Just me, my diddly little self, and I. Don't diddle yourself. I get it. You seem pretty cool to hang out with. Alright, enough. One more wo word like that and I'm done with you. Oh. Move. I need to loot this. They never... 
They never ever fix obvious problems with old content. Just move forward. Oh, with the Warframe? That's a bad sign. I jump ship from Warframe after I figure out that they release dog shit quality updates and then move on to the next update. That's uh that's super bummer. Give Bust the Possum compliment. Oh give him a compliment. Here you go. Are you done? Are you done with the nonsense? I'm sorry I ever said anything nice about it. Actually, underneath that grab exterior, I think you're secretly really nice. What is your problem exactly? I told you not to say anything, say things like that. I'm actually the biggest jerk you've ever met. And you're probably the biggest one I've ever met. Okay. Take the sign next to the motel. I did that. How's the construction site going? Press the green button. It's ready. Astounding! You're on your way to become the biggest hospitality developer on this side of the canyon. You're currently in position one out of one. Yeah, that's not bad. It is certainly something. As a leisure expert, I'm sure that your senses are now precisely tuned to the next step in this possibly yet not probably profitable operation. Expect the humans to come over. Trick the humans to come over! I mean, I mean, offer a valued customer a room for lodging. Okay. Build a bedroom and book it. Okay. Well, I have a bedroom, but I don't have anything in there that I need. So let's build it. Um, build one of those. One of these, one of these, and inventory. Put this back in here. That goes there. Wardrobe goes there. Wait a minute. I got these backwards, don't I? That'll work, I guess. Shit. I got nothing. That's fine. Um. Do I have a buddy down here? There's a trash over here, I think. Nice. Hey, Barbara. Let's get, um... F69 painting. A nightstand. A rug. A little plant. And a light. Fuck. No. I bought it. Phew. Oh, and a welcome sign. Can I book someone real quick? Guest request. Ah! Uh, I don't have hygiene ready, so let's not do that. I'm hoping... Build a bedroom and book it. I don't want to. I don't have hygiene. Why can't I... There, jeez. Welcome, Matt. Why is this all jacked up? This doesn't feel right. Go away, bug. It'll fit there. Love that. Have this. Have that. Have that. And have that. This one feels a little bit cozier for some reason. It's fine. Okay. Um, I don't want to book someone because I have no hygiene, but I can't complete this until I have hygiene.
Can I buy blueprints from you? Damn it. I need blueprints. Maybe um, we'll just wait for like tomorrow and then the character or like the refresh of the people, they won't need hygiene. I'm not sure because otherwise I'm going to get a bad review and I don't want a bad review. Travel to, oh, really? I can't manage my stuff. Oh, that's annoying. Unavailable still. Okay. I guess we'll go back to Timber Crossing. Alright, at least I can take a nap. Or sleep. Yes, reviews. Great, lovely experience, great host. Oh, they all they all say the same thing every time. That's fine. Okay, well, nap time, I guess. Just pass that on the ground right in front of it. <laughs> You guys have completed their stays. Cool. Uh, let's do 17. Fuck. 19. Oh, that's that's my ratings. Guest request. Here you go. All right. Uh, FIBA. I don't like that it doesn't. Do they just like switch up their rooms? Why 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 aren't you staying? Why doesn't it show me which rooms are occupied? That's fucking weird. You know? Okay. Let's go back. Boo. see if I can uh, get someone else in here now. They all need hygiene. Fuck. Where do I get the hygiene shit? Maybe just activating it will unlock it. Why be in debt from a bank when you could just borrow from your future? Press the green button. I've got a guess in the way. Astounding! They are in for, for there you are in for a surprise of a lifetime. Take that as you will. Sure. Because of our premium desert location, we are freely able to exploit a common resource to their benefit and our profit. I'm not sure who's exploiting who. That's right! Water! Is mutual exploitation a thing? Due to our never-ending quest for patron excellence and unfortunate health and safety regulations, this location can support sanitary facilities, which are now a key expectation for any visitor of this location. Can you guess what the next step is? Not sure. You you sure use a lot of words to say very few things. Correct! You must now build bathrooms for your guests. Nice. Aha! There we go. Lucky guess. Bathrooms introduce a new type of score. Hygiene. Bathrooms have an area of effect around them that applies that hygiene score to nearby bedrooms. Oh. So I need to build that in the middle. You can see the area effect of bathroom by going to the build mode and selecting the bathroom. Higher level bathrooms have a larger area of effect for their hygiene score. Increase the level of bathrooms by placing higher level bathroom objects. Different guests have different hygiene requirements, so try to match them when accepting requests. Okay. We're figuring things out. Let's build some things. 
crafting, crappy toilet, wooden shower, bathroom sink. Poop. All right. Um. Well, for now, this is fine, right? Crappy toilet. With a sink next to it. And a shower. There you go. That can work. Oh god, that's awful. Oh wow. The area on that is... Quite large. There's good decoration in there? Damn. <laughs> I like that the, uh, the toilet and stuff count as decoration. Yeah, we'll have to we'll have to move all that stuff soon. Build a functional bathroom in the motel. Done. Hey, friend. It's like mooching off your own future. A screen button. All right, there's bathrooms now. Amazing. Now that your guests need for immediate relief are met, we should turn our attention to the most important motivation behind renting a room in this motel. Being comfortable? Taking some time off? Repression. That's what my. That was my third guess. Recognizing the insight into customer motivation towards your product is a key detail of modern marketing. You're doing the thing again. Why would anyone stay in this scum hole? Hey, you put a lot of work into this place. That's right! Running away from what you can't escape! Shady pawn shop debt collectors. Yourself! That's a little dark. Which is a perfect opportunity from one of our most popular facilities. A bar! That's worse. But not just any bar. A tasteful, sophisticated establishment. A distillery. Okay. How refined. Special rooms provide extra attraction to your resort. They offer special amenities and entertainment to your guests. Some guests have demands for special, specific special rooms, but all guests appreciate them in general. Special rooms can be a big boost to your resort prestige score. The destroyer is a type of special room that can only be built in certain areas. It's great for those who are looking to unwind alongside some hearty spirits. It requires a bar, seating, and dispenser to be functional. Some guests specifically look for a distillery for their accommodations. Okay. Well, maybe I do move this stuff now. Um. How do I do move this? It's quite large. One, two, three, four. Okay, it expands four outwards. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. It's like half of it. So I should do We're gonna put this stuff back. And then we're going to how do I remove that room Leap. there it is all right one two three four and then one two and then we got one two three four one two three four okay um I could probably put it in the center. Something like one, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, let's build the distillery first.
absolutely. Okay, let's um. Nope. Four by five. Okay, so if I do, this needs to move. If I do a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three. There we go. There's a distillery. Um, I do need to build... Oops. Oh, shit. How much money was that? How much money do I have? 500. Oh, thank God. I didn't think I was going to be able, be able to build a, a bathroom after that. enough iron nails. Fuck. Where do I get those? Oh, I had enough. Lucky me. Alright, let's move this. Then we're gonna build a room. One, two, three. So it needs to be about here. Wait, did I do that wrong? Why does it feel like one, two? I did that wrong. That's why. There we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Okay, cool. So those are being affected, which is great. Um, let's throw some stuff down. Uh, bathroom sink. Toilet. Shower. Nice. Um, and then bar. Oh, I need three of those. Oh, can this just go anywhere? Hold on. Two more stools. There are invalid objects present in this room. No, there's not. What are you talking about? Is it just doing that annoying bug again? Oh. Does someone have to walk behind that? Is that what that's saying? That might have been it. confused. Oh. Why isn't it working? Have a good one, Birch. Sleep well, my friend. I hope you have a great night. Why can't I build this? There are no invalid objects. None. You're lying to me. There's nothing here. I 
I can't build this fucking room. Oh, wait, that's the bathroom. No wonder. Fucking bathroom. That was driving me nuts. All right, I need more bar stools. Let's build some of those. Can I fit another one of these? Let's see. I can if I do it this way. Okay. I don't want to move that for now. Are we good now? Distillery is done. Participants in the Pond Voyage and Pond Cruise programs agree to waive any claim for participants' personal injury on or wrongful death. That's the green button. The most sophisticated distillery is ready. Excellent! You are one of them. You are one step closer to solidifying this. Wow, I just skipped that before even reading what that said. Establishment? As the premier watering hole in this entire desert. Couldn't have asked for anything better. As we near the consolidation of yet another premium property, we obviously need to make sure our rigorous standards are met. Obviously. Uh, new items. To that degree, you will need to satisfy a series of criteria. Complete the stay of three guests. Okay. I think I actually have money to do that. Oh. Oh, look at these. This is all my money. Level two bedroom object, huh? Vanity table, footbrush. Uh, bed. And that seems... Something more interesting right now. I'm stuck. No, oh, my inventory was just open. An idiot. Alright. Build a. Is there a way to hide some of these things that you don't want to see anymore? What is this? Oh, that requires special materials. Got it. Oops. Well, at least I have it now. Alright. One, two, three. Is this? 
I think it was that. There we go. Uh, all right. I do oops what if we do one oh god damn it one, two three one two oh, but that thing's still in the way oops I always push escape door on there. Get it. Ah. I need a door. There. There we have rooms. gotta be a better way to set that up. <sighs> hmm. Alright. Well, I'm gonna... Can I save? Can I save the game? How do I save the game? Options. Quit to main menu. This is where I'm gonna end it, my friends, because it's 11.40. I technically put it in my normal stream time here, but um, I'm getting tired now. Um, so I'm gonna go try to go get some sleep. Let's see. Um, maybe we can go send some loves off to a friend, maybe? Mayhaps? Mayhaps. I started stream, like, right when uh, Kim started streaming, too. She's probably playing Stardew or something. Let us see. Actually, you know what? It's getting late. And I'm pretty much just going to go directly to sleep. Um, so I don't really have time to raid and hang out for a bit. I hate to raid and run. Uh, sometimes I got to do it. Um, but I think this is where I'm just going to call it. And I'm going to go to sleep. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the game. Um, I'm enjoying it. It's it's cute. We might have to do a little uh, revisit of it. Maybe we'll play some more this weekend or something. I'm not sure. But I appreciate you guys hanging out with are hanging out with me. Remember to spay new to your pets, adopt, don't shop, donate to a risk if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out that are very much in need. Anyways, I'm Vasive. Thank you so much for letting me be a streamer tonight. I heavily appreciate it, and I'll catch you all next time. See ya! Did you want to go bedtime? Want to go bedtime? I know, come on, let's go. <laughs>